So time for the final race of the day. Already in the eight races have gone by. In a flash this is the long distance flat race over two miles. And the top one is Boss Burner for Conrad Liggett who's also got Enchando Beer. Charming Humour for David Hooney, Cabo Zarad, Darren Thompson, Unilight for Craig Allen, The Bell Ringer for Joshua Sutherland, Wizard for Martin Leadham, Wharton Bassett for Michael Scala, Viva Cadiz for Paul Rhodes, Mission Patrol for Graham Clutterbuck, who's also got October Breeze, Houston Obsessive for Vinnie Gerard, Mentalia, Alex Cherry, So I Told You, David Hooney, Zagama, Darren Thompson, Kakorna Festival and Friends 4 for David Robertson, Chippy Grand for... Craig Allen, Baroness Longford for Jim Murray, 7th Bride for Martin Leader and Bakersfield Accelerate, Vinnie Gerrard. So, all called in there, all called in, in the stalls, and away they go. And the final time today, they break away with Mintalia, probably just about the early leader, but they're pretty tightly packed at the moment and trying to sort themselves out into some sort of racing formation. There's a long way to go, though, and it's two miler and plenty of time to get yourself into position. And Houston Obsessive and Mentalia are the two that have gone on them as they come up to pass the winning post. And they've got a complete circuit of the Ascot track to go with. Houston Obsessive for Vinnie Gerard on the inside of Mentalia for Alex Cherry in second. Bit of a gap then, three or four lengths or so to Cabo Zarad who's in third place. Then comes seventh bride after that one with Baroness Longford and Zagama. Viva Cadiz is also close up. Baroness Longford in those black and red colours which I don't think is Jim Murray today. Um, he usually is, but I'm pretty sure Jim Murray's not involved today. And it's Houston Obsessive in the lead then from Mentalia in second. Cabo Zarad is back in third. And then October Breeze in seventh bride with Mission Patrol and Zagama after that one. Then Baroness Longford with Friends 4 and Riva Cadiz. Used to be well strung out. And Houston Obsessive is going along nicely through the rain in the lead and this final race of the final trials day well virtually the final trials day will be back either later in the week or next weekend i'm not sure when it depends how long they take to handicap these what we've got we've got two new handicappers for next season and they're going to get a bit of a pre-season practice in by handicapping these races that we've run today and then they're going to be rerun with the handicap weights and see what sort of difference we get just to give them an idea of their calculations are working so that should be pretty interesting next week we did that last, last season as well it seemed to go reasonably successfully but it's Houston Obsessive who's in the lead from Mentalia in second Cabo Zarad is third and then Mission Patrol is fourth then Baroness Longford after that one and Zagama and Viva Kid is seventh bride and the purple and white stripes is on the inside of that one then Bakersfield Accelerate Stable Companion of the Leader with Friends 4 and Uni Light on the outside of that one, then Wizard is after that one with Uni Light. Looking towards the back, Chippy Grand is just the back marker at this stage. So Houston Obsessive continues to show the way, they're already inside the final five furlongs with Cabo Zarad in second, his stablemate Zagama is in third, October Breeze is fourth, seventh bride is after that one, then comes Mission Patrol and Mentalia, and Viva Cadiz, Friends 4, Baroness Longford is next, Bakersfield Accelerate's going to try and come round the outside of the lot of them, also try to make some good ground up round the outside, it's charming humour, but it's still Houston Obsessive in the lead with three to go, from Cabo Zarad in second and Zagama in third, then comes Mission Patrol, October Breeze, Friends 4 and seventh bride after that one, Bakersfield Re Accelerate, Baroness Longford, Longford is trying to run on as well, also trying to come through from the back there, Charming Humour still and also wider on the outside, Kakaona Festival, Friends 4 also trying to get there as well, but they're inside the final furlong and a half and it's still Houston Obsessive in the lead, being chased by the Darren Thompson pair, but it's, it's still in the lead, Houston Obsessive, Zagamo, Chippy Grand's been pulled up on the back, Houston Obsessive then inside the final half furlong, now being pressed by Cabo Zarad, Cabo Zarad takes it up, Cabo Zarad in the lead, he's beginning to take it on now, up towards the line, Cabo Zarad takes it from Houston Obsessive, Baroness Longford, Zagamo, a charming humor Bakersfield accelerate mission patrol after that one and all the way back to Boss Burner who was the last one to finish and it's been a good day for Darren Thompson uh, he gets first and fourth again Cabo Zarad taking it then for Darren Thompson. Houston Obsessive for Vinnie Gerard was second. Baroness Longford, it was Jim Murray who was in third. So apologies there. Jim Zagama for Darren Thompson was fourth. Charming Humour for David Hooley was fifth. So that's your final trials day race. And then some pretty exciting races there. And the uh, handicappers will now have a good few days studying them and 
scratching their heads and figuring out what to do and how to do it and then we can all come back and run the whole lot all over again.